Justin, a uh, big FA Cup game under the lights and I think the players uh, shone on that today. Yeah, well, the players played for us today. We met the management team. I thought they put their bodies on the line. Um, people coming off with bad injuries, um, bruises, sweating. And as a manager, that's all you ask for. Um, mm. Last two games, we conceded seven goals. We had to be tighter today. And I think we was. Yes, and they were a very good team. For me, they're the best team we played at the first mm. three games. And um, the boys, when you put the effort in, you get your rewards. It feels all sweeter. And apart from Marlow, I wasn't too disappointed. Um, maybe one the first goal of error, but the performance, I thought, was OK, apart from the last 20 minutes. Tuesday where up until when we was 2-1 up I was happy after that I thought we, we, we went to pot and it was very poor and I was disappointed and I was like I said there was a lot of players that I had to change and there's a lot of players that I felt were playing for the shirt to stay at the club um, some of those have redeemed themselves today and, and, and it's pleasing to see uh, this man next to me I thought his work effort from the front was outstanding uh, Sorry Nana well done your uh, Barking TV's man of the match mm -hmm. Cheers, uh, Thank you Obviously it was a it was a hard game but you boys battled through it battled through, battled through it yeah, it was a tough game. Um, I think in terms of the three games, this was the game where, you know, as a unit, we were together. You know, we, we collectively knew that this was a, a game we had to win, uh, especially coming off the two defeats. Um, so we were solid, we were together. Uh, and I think it showed in the way we played. Um, everyone was just backing each other up. Uh, we had that confidence, when, especially when we got the first goal, that we were always in it. Um, even going 1-1 uh, for the draw, we knew there was always something in it. So we pushed, you know, and we got the win, and I'm just delighted for the, for the boys and uh, for the fans as well. We came down to watch and obviously over a pre-season, uh, two new coaches have came in, had to adjust to a new style of play, mm -hmm. and I think tonight it just gelled. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it's, it's, it's a great system. Uh, first day we, we came in thinking, uh, we know what system are we going to play, but the coaches have done well. You know, they, they, we bought into what they've, what they've taught and um, we're seeing it flourish. You know, we're having more of the ball, you know, we're confident. Um, and I think ultimately it's going to make us better players come uh, last game of the season. And Justin, obviously, Hereford up next, and that will be another tough game. Yeah, yeah, it will be a tough game, and it's, we need to get some lead points on the ball now. Hopefully, we can get confidence in this game into uh, Monday. We'll get an extra day's rest from them because they'll be playing tomorrow, so hopefully, that plays a um, benefit to us. And the boys need to rest up now. Um, and yeah, like I said, it's a lead game, we need to get some points on the ball. So, hopefully, it's a turning point. I don't think we've, I don't think it's a, um, um, a total turning point, but it, it, it's building blocks. And uh, as long as we continue to build blocks and put more bricks on the, on the building, I'll be happy. All right, thanks, Justin, and thanks, Anna. No worries.